Welcome back to BNG Hockey, where it's always black and gold. The Bruins are really scraping the bottom of the barrel now when it comes to free agent signings, but this one intrigued me a little bit, so let's talk about it real quick. The Bruins signed forward Riley Tufty to a one-year contract with a cap hit of $775,000. He's a 26-year-old, 6'6", left shot, left winger, originally selected in the first round of the 2016 draft, 25th overall to the Dallas Stars. Oddly enough, that's one pick after Max Jones, the Bruins' most recent free agent signing before Tufty. And now they're going to be teammates. He most recently played for the Colorado Eagles of the AHL, where in 67 games he set career highs in goals with 23, assists with 22, and points with 45, and was also named an AHL All-Star. And fun fact, he won the hardest shot competition as well. In five games with the Colorado Avalanche last season, he scored one goal, one assist for a total of two points. And his entire NHL career, he's only played in 18 games, scoring two goals, one assist for a total of three points. Now, as you heard from those numbers, I don't expect this player to light it up at the NHL level. In fact, he might not even make the Bruins roster. But I like that the Bruins are throwing darts at the board here with young players who still haven't found their game but are on the right track. And this guy's coming off a career year at the AHL level. If nothing else, he can really help you out at the Providence level, help some of your younger guys develop and play with a good player at the AHL level. But if this guy does make the roster, you could have a gigantic fourth line. And I love that the Bruins continue to bring in all this size and maybe become one of the biggest teams in the NHL. They were already pretty good, but now after these signings, they have some monsters. And you could have a fourth line with Tufty at 6 foot 6, Brazo at 6 foot 5, and Castellick at center at 6 foot 4. And I would love to see that. I want to switch it up. The Ruins bottom 6 has been a little stale, so I like that it seems like we're going to have almost an entire new group fighting for roster spots. And this is another guy who can bring some competition or a little bit of a safety value if guys like Merkulov, Lysel, and Beecher aren't ready to make the jump. But I do hope that those guys are ready to go because I'd much rather see them blossom into the player I expect them to be than give a guy like this an opportunity. So I see him being like a Patrick Brown type player. He's always there playing well at the AHL level for you, but he plays a couple games here and there. But you never know. It's another dart at the board for Don Sweeney and something I thought was worth talking about. Let me know your thoughts. Do you think Tufty's going to make the Bruins roster? Leave that down below in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a big like. And if you haven't already, subscribe.